Fred is loyal, Fred does what he says he's going to do, you're more likely to find Fred at Frank's Diner than at Ruth Crisp. So he's, he's very authentic. He's a person that always instilled in me to continually reinvent yourself and reinvent your company. Fred's roots are in engineering. You know, he's our CEO, but he's an engineer by heart. Uh, Fred loves technology. He's keen on technology, and he's always looking for how we can use technology to either solve problems or make new products. What I see with Fred is a couple of things. It's not only innovation. Yes, he wants to make sure that Gentex is always on the cutting edge, uh, but it's a very, very rigorous and disciplined approach to innovation. Fred's a family guy first. It's about family, his own personal family, and then the families of his employees. He loves his employees. Fred's open to listening to his employees, uh, and he has just a tremendous appetite for learning. We are scientists, we like to you know, explore new things, and uh, sometimes things uh, were exciting. Look at this one, you know, can do this, and you talk to Fred. Fred always brings us back, say, where's the business sense? If you meet Fred on the street, you will not know he's the CEO of a billion dollar company, have more than 5,000 employees, has been in business for 40 years, uh, produce electrochromic mirrors, uh, which will have 90% of market share to all the world. He's just a person you can talk to, you can talk anything with the weather, with your kids, with your family, with the market, and the Wall Street, and the technology. He's just a person easy to talk to. The innovation people think about is the widget. Come up with a new idea and that's going to be the, the billion dollar idea. For us as a company, innovation is all the way through every part of our system. It's from everything we do when we hire a person and the approaches we take to find the right people all the way through the manufacturing processes to make the process more efficient and get more product through it. We innovate every day, not just in what that end product is. What Fred spends a lot of time on is trying to help us see the failures he's personally ran into so that as we go forward and innovate on new products or processes that we're not chasing the same thing. That's where the law of halves comes from. He's seen it a hundred times, going after elephants. It's, it's where the core philosophies come from. Well, I think is, you know, the four foundations of what we do, the ownership mentality, the innovation, the quality, right, the unpretentious management, to me are, are pretty fundamental to, one, who Fred is, and then what he's also instilled in the organization. One of his greatest strengths is in blazing a trail with new technology to fill needs that the current products can't. 